Aaron. Mm. Megan. Megan. Um, uh, no, excuse me. Excuse me. Megan, that behaviour's unacceptable. I don't like it when you pinch me. Not I unacceptable. don't like it. If you Gabby, scratch me or pinch me or punch me or behave in a way that is unacceptable, then you will go back I'm into that room. Unacceptable. No back chat with me either. And that's your warning. Megan's having a real hard time accepting that her parents are supporting the changes in the house. And as a result, she's blaming me and taking all her anger and frustrations out on me. Megan, Joe's just told you. Well, it's and called I'm, the household rules. And Joe's part of the household at the moment and she's helping no, us to put them in not. place. Megan, that's back chat and that's your warning. If you want to talk to me again like that, you're going to go back in the room for nine minutes. Megan? Yeah, I guess Megan's sort of under the impression that when Joe goes, everything will go re return to normal and then she'll be fine and it's just this woman that's coming and turn her life upside down. Yeah, it's your fault, Joe. It's you who's making me cry. Why am I making you cry? Because you're being horrible to everyone, aren't you? Is that what you think? It's being okay, stupid. It's See what she's made us do. She hasn't made us happy at all. Megan, would you like to talk to me about this? No. It's crucial that Megan grasps that her parents are the authoritative figures here. What she thinks is that I'm in the middle and creating this. Are you listening? Joe has come here to help us, and we will be a really happy Megan, family. Listen to me. Not I'm not cross. Us. Am I cross? You're not really going to make us happy. It will make us a much happier you family. Won't. And when she's gone, we'll still be doing the same things. Good night, Megan. It's <laughs> okay. The plan for today was to work on Mum and Megan's relationship. So I introduced the special thought box. And I've come up with an idea that I think will help Mummy and Daddy understand and listen to you. And also it will help you to be able to say what's on your mind and how you're feeling. OK? This box. OK, it's a pretty box. It's called the thought box. The thought box is there to encourage Megan to express whatever's on her mind. And that way, Mummy can read your thoughts and you can discuss it. Do you think that's a good idea? Yeah. Yeah, OK, marvellous. The thought box is an idea to help Megan express herself. There's a lot of anger going on in the household between Megan and her mother, so it's important that Megan gets to express her feelings and that her mother validates them. Megan and Mum desperately needed a recipe of some good old one-on-one -on -one time together, so I had a little something in mind. That it would be really lovely if you went ice skating with Mummy this morning, just you and Mummy. That's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that wicked. That would be wicked. Really <laughs> So excited, and just seeing Megan say she was squeezing my hand, and just so excited. She's beside herself, and it's lovely to see her, like, and I'm excited too. <laughs> what this will do is build up Denise's confidence with Megan, so that she can enjoy spending time with her, and so that Megan can understand that not only will Denise give her discipline but that she can enjoy the pleasant times with her too and have fun. You're doing really, really, really well. I can't believe you're doing so well, considering you've never been on them. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I had loads of fun. Loads and loads of fun.